Hello, my name is Paul Henry, Security and Forensic Analyst at Lumension. Welcome to our Patch Tuesday update for July 2010. Now, Microsoft today announced they'd release four security bulletins to address five separate current vulnerabilities. Especially concerning this month is the fact that all three bulletins are rated critical, also rated one in Microsoft's Exploitability Index. Now, MS 10-042 addresses a vulnerability that is actively being exploited. Additionally, MS 10-043 requires a reboot and affects Windows Server 2008 64-bit machines, which could be especially disruptive to some environments. MS 10-042 and MS 10-043 cover vulnerabilities in the Windows Help and Support Center and a mechanical display driver. Respectively, they are rated critical, as the vulnerabilities addressed allow for remote code execution, typically the most feared exploit type. Now, MS 10-043 could impact a large swath of Microsoft customers as it affects Windows 7 desktop users and Windows 2008 servers, which are Microsoft's most current desktop server deployment solutions. Now, given the active exploit code that has been circulated, MS 10-043 should be prioritized in testing and hence deployments. Now, MS 10-044 and MS 10-045 affect Microsoft Office. While MS 10-044 is rated critical, fortunately its impact will be limited to those organizations that have built or utilized applications and processes based on Microsoft Access. MS 10-045 is only rated important, but we do want to strongly encourage users to pay attention to this since it addresses a vulnerability in Microsoft Outlook, Microsoft's hugely popular email client. Remote code execution vulnerabilities in email clients are always a huge concern. Now, IT teams that have both Microsoft and Oracle in-house are really getting a double whammy this Patch Tuesday, as Oracle is also releasing a very large security update that covers 59 vulnerabilities in literally hundreds of Oracle applications. Now, the list of affected products include Oracle Database 11G, 10G, and 9i, Oracle WebLogic Server, Oracle J Rukip, Oracle eBusiness Suite, and various PeopleSoft Enterprise products. Oracle is recommending that these patches be applied as soon as possible. This has been our Patch Tuesday update for July 2010. Thank you for listening.